everybody, I am back better than ever. Not really, I'm tired as shit, but anyway, I am here to do a video for you. And we have what's called an over-under. Do you believe this shit, Jordan? An over-under. How did we get an over-under through all this? Hard battles that we've gone through. An over-under we have today, people. We have, yes, over-under. For all of you people that don't know what an over-under is, I go through the boat, I give you the boat, we get the pricing, I tell you if it's overpriced or undervalued. Bling! Super simple. And that's in my eyes. Not yours, of course. My opinion, not yours. But, anyway, there you go. That's the lowdown. We have it for you. We have the Avid 21XB Elite. There's only been a couple boats that have been Elite, Jordan, so I think we're off to a bad start to begin with. Okay? Elite, tin, has to be really good. But, it is a Avid 21XB Elite. Boom. All right, so, we got a call from Phil. Wait, no, we didn't get a call from Phil. We reached out, actually we had Zach from Bill's Marine reach out to us and said, you got questions on the Avid stuff, give me a call, I'll take care of it. So, Jordan and his highly professional media team, which is all standing behind the camera right now. If, I, if you could see them all, you'd be crazy. See how many people are standing with Jordan right now. But, it's only one. They don't know that. Why would you wreck that, Neil? One. One. Anyway, so we couldn't get Philip on the phone for the last two years. And so Zach from Bill's Marines like, hey, give me a call. We got to talk. So Jordan and his crew ring him up. Bing. And they talk for a, quite a while about the Avid 21XB Elite. Um, Philip, I know you're not listening, but you should send a Super Z shirt to Zach at Bill's Marine because he sealed the deal. But by the time we're done, we'll see if he really did. Here we go. Ready? Jordan, what do you got the hat yeah. for? Available at They are right now? Yep. We got them back up? Yep. All right. Bam. They're back on teammarineservice.com. Or you just didn't want to see my bald head. Which one? Both. Okay. Great. They cover up the baldness really well. Got it. Perfect. Here we go. All right. So Zach at Bill's Marine says he likes to order them in just plain bolt. Right, Jordan? So that's bolt motor trailer. He likes to order them in that way. Then you can build them. Which is kind of cool. It's a damn good idea, I think. But anyway, so how he orders them comes with the Yamaha 250 SHO, the brand new one. Uh, bolt motor trailer with prep and freight from Bill's Marine starts at, ready Jordan? Yep. $64,369. 64K. That's what you start with your Super Sensational Elite 10. Bam. $60, $64,000. Boom. Accessories. Trolling motor batteries. All right. Comes with no trolling motor and 31 battery trays or battery, one 31 battery. It comes with one 31 battery, but no trolling motor, okay? Um, so we added them in Coda Ultrax. Bam, 112.45 iPilot. Uh, three 31 series batteries, 127 group battery, obviously for cranking, correct? That's what we went with. Um, included is a 440D charger, Minn Kota. So it comes with one 31 battery, no trolling motor, but it give you a fucking charger? Yep. That's how it comes. That's how they have it. That, well, that's how they started out. Yeah. Okay, all right, good. So you could probably get it with nothing, I'm thinking, and then just build it that way too. All right, but that's what we did. Okay, so now we're getting into electronics. So this is how we do this. We run two 10s at the console and two 12s at the bow. That's how we do it. And then we add a little bit here and there, but every boat that we do this on when it comes to if we have the room, should we say, Jordan? This is how we do it. Twin 10s, twin 12s, live, link, ding, ding, bomb, bomb, jing, jing, ka, ka, beep, all that crap. That guy sounded like a rap, didn't it? I could rap with you on that. All right, Neil, you want to do a rap? Where the hell is Neil? Neil's gone, he quit. All right, console electronics. Comes with no units. We're dropping the two tens like we just talked about at the console. Swam! We're right there. All right, we got the Helix MSI 10 down right there. Bow electronics doesn't come with shit. Uh, we put in the two Hummingbird Helix 12 MSI gens, Gen 4s right there. Swam! Right down on the deck. There they are. They are um, up there with the Mega Live. So that's what we got 12s. 10s, mega live, bunch of shit going on. We're gonna see a bunch of fish, we're not gonna catch anything. But we're gonna look good doing it. Here we go, miscellaneous options. Here, this is where it gets good. Uh, we added two power pole blades, and that's what we do. We always add the blades, brackets, combo, bam, on the back of all these bolts, all right? Um, included, it comes with the hot foot, so that comes included. That's, that's already built into this price, right? All right, so just so you people know, if we're saying included, it is already built into the price. Included is the hot foot with the slide. The Atlas jack plate, which we think is a six inch or an eight inch, can't really tell, um, six or eight. Uh, blinker trim, comes with that. Probably dual blinker, lever, I don't know what you wanna call them. They're just 
paddle, I don't know. You're just, whatever you know, you know what I'm talking about by now. Um, included, one bike one bike seat. Bike? Banana seat? Or a f***ing banana seat on there? Don't we call them butt seats? Anyway. Uh, one fold down seat, that's for Jordan in the back. So when he's filming, he doesn't fall out. Uh, we got a padded front deck. So if you got, you're got fishing up there all day, maybe your golden retriever, which I have a lot of right now, wants to sit by, at least they're comfortable. Um, included is the, that's it. That's it for included, that's all we got. No more included. We add, every time, precision sonar mounts. So we use the precision sonar mounts brackets for the council and for up front, that's what we added. So we added the up front bow mount and the council mount, that's added on. Trailer options, for you guys that don't know, I like trailers to look nice. So we usually try to pimp out the trailer. We like to put the rims, we like to get the spinners, we like the lights, we like all that stuff. So when the boat's not on it, it should still look cool. But here we go, let's see what happens. Trailer options, ratchet tie downs, which is standard. I mean, they're <laughs> uh, trailer axle with brakes, both axles. You get four all the way around. Piss on it, let's do it, let's run four. That comes, that's how it comes. Or did we add? No, nope, comes that way, all right. Swing away tongue, pull the pin, let her swing. Got it. And then it comes with eight, I can't get bigger? Nope. What do you mean? Things you can go. 18? Yep. Are they wide? They're mag? Yeah. They're big? Yeah. They look cool? I don't think they look cool at all. Do I get that silly step that was on that one right there? Yeah. The old man steps built into this price? Yeah. Okay, so I get the old man, you didn't put the old man step here. Wow. People may want the stairway to heaven. The stairway of heaven does come with it, and it looks pretty badass on the Avid thing here. Um, it's scrolling. If Jordan's other camera guy would swing over to it, you'd be able to see it, but that guy's not included right now. But anyway, we're back to the trailer. We have 18-inch mag rims that are bitching um, with matching spare. So we got five matching rims with matching tires, and we are set to travel. Done. That's it. That's all we get. And we get a big tin boat that's 21 foot long, and they call it the XB Elite. That's what we're getting. All right, this is this is bad. Quick rundown before we get to a grand total because everybody wants to know the grand total. We started at 64,000. We added the trolling motor, we added the series, we added uh, four batteries, 331, actually, I guess we could say three batteries because it came with 131, 127. We added the 440D charger, and we do that on every one too. That's, that's basic. This is all what we do, unless we drop a lithium, but if we drop a lithium, we'll let you know that we're dropping a lithium. We didn't add the lithium, we went with probably flooded here, correct? Yep. So we went with flooded. Um, then we dropped the two tens, the two twelves. Um, the trolling motor that's up front is the. Did you put that on here? Yeah. Yeah. Altrex comes with it. Altrex, or we got to order that. Altrex comes with it. Okay. One twelve Altrex MBI. So that that's what we put on the front. Um, Mega Live got that, and it come, we got the two poles on it, and then it comes with the hot foot, comes with that jack plate. We think it's a six or an eight inch blinker trim. Um, one bike seat, one fold down seat, padded front deck, and the precision sonar mounts that we add to every boat that we do. Uh, trailer options are simple. We get a ratchet tie down, tandem axle with four brakes, uh, swing away tongue, fold the pin, let her swing, and 18 inch mag wheels matching spare for a grand total of $84,519. And they're selling these? Yep. Eighty, eighty-five grand. How did we add twenty-one thousand dollars? What did we buy? Because it doesn't come with anything. You might as well buy a fucking glass boat. No, Johnny will sell you one, right? I'll sell you one for cheaper. With the two fifty, Merc. Yeah. Which sometimes they don't shift. Sometimes they leak water. Oh, yeah. um. Hmm. Eighty-five thousand dollars for that. I mean, in the pictures it looks pretty cool, but it is tin, which they say it performs very well, right? From what I understand, that this Avid boat does perform just as good. Not just as good as glass, but better than everybody else's tin. From what we're hearing. I've never touched this boat, I've never seen this boat, I've never even smelt this boat. So that means I haven't driven this boat, so you can't. I can't base it on anything. But this is what we're hearing, that that Avid boat performs very well. Now, it would take a lot for me to think that this Avid boat is built better than a Gator Trax. 
You agree, Jordan? Yeah. I mean, because gator traps blew me out of the water when it came when it came to the to their bass style boat. Um, performance wise, I don't know. Did he give you any numbers on performance? What the single do at wide open? No, uh, there's no data on this, but there's data on their website of uh, some of their other models. Go to their website if you're Go really, really, website. yeah, if you're really interested. Yeah. Eighty-five thousand dollars is overpriced. That's I'm at that. That's just how it is. That's nothing against Zach at Bills Marine. Nothing against Bills Marine. That's against Avid and eighty-five thousand dollars. I'm going to get into a glass boat at eighty-five k. Now, if we ended at sixty-four, I think we're probably in that ballpark. Don't you think, Jordan? Yeah. I don't understand how the motor's twenty. So the trailer and the boat's forty-four, forty-five thousand bucks. And the paint, I can't forget the paint, right? Carpet, padded, but we added that. So, um, eighty-five thousand bucks is too much for me for a Avid Twenty XB Elite that is tin. Twenty-one. 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 Yeah, good call. Avid Twenty-one XB that is tin. Um, no. I think. Did we not? What was the FX Skeeter? Hundred and four. 102 to 20 foot. Yeah. I mean, you're less than 20 grand away from that. You might as well just keep right on a rolling. I mean, they'll, they'll finance it for the next two decades, probably. Whew. But we know we know you can get into a Johnny boat better better than that. The 20 foot nitro glass boat was 78, I think. But we're at 21, though. But you can get into a glass boat with a 250, 20 foot, yep, yep, yep. And get nitro rewards or nitro savings if you cash in and be a big winner. Like Jackson. Like Jackson, yeah, you get. Jackson! Yes. What'd you get on your nitro contingency money this year? How much did you win? Nothing. That's shit. You were supposed to say like 20,000. We were trying to pimp the program. Oh, no, I mean, even if I did win, they'd probably tell me that I fucked something up, so I couldn't get it. I mean, that's probably what they do. Huh. Rude, fucking rude. Um, yeah. So there you go. My opinion on the Avid Twenty One XB Elite is she's overpriced. Your opinion is up to you. Get over there, check out. I mean, if you really think you want to see this Avid, go go on Bill's Marine, right? Get on Bill's Marine site. Go over there. Uh, get a hold of Zach. See what, see what Zach's got to say. Zach's got one for sale right now, right? It was his boat. He ordered it, but then he's now got another crib midget coming. Yep. Right, so he can't ha can't have this boat. So he's since then ordered a pontoon or a sea switch, maybe. So that way he can take the family and the crib midget. So, hmm, yeah, uh -huh. hmm. Can't have the avid because it can. There goes baby. Put the parachute on. All right, so that's it. That is our avid 21 XB Elite over or under. It's definitely over price for what you're getting. Um, starting out at 65, ending at 85, 20,000 dollars worth of stuff going on here. 21,000 dollars worth of shit. I don't know. It's overpriced for me, Jordan. You got an opinion on this? Would you buy one? What about you and your soon-to-be bride rocking the Abbott? Nope. Not gonna happen. Not happening. Hmm. Weird. Fucking rude. Maybe Jackson will be in one next year. You're gonna be a 21 Abbott XB tin boat. No. Why? What you spent? You spent all that on your nitro. At least it's glass. And your contingency money. Right. Right. That's where it's at. The contingency money. There you go. That's it. The over under for Avid Boat 21 XB is over. I am out. So as always, hey, Jordan, you didn't tell me to do this at the beginning, and I fucked up. That's I, all right. I fucked it up. That's all right. All right. Here we go. Boom. Rocking it again. We're climbing. We just dropped a. Quick video today, or a couple days ago on, it was like, a, what do we call these shorts that you're, that you're doing now? You got me doing these shorts? Yep. Yeah, it went it went ballistic. Like, it was out of control right away, and it was just a simple prop wrench that Dave at DD26 did. Um, huge numbers on it. It was crazy, but it's a great product. Go check out Dave, too, DD26. Hey, if you're in this industry and you're thinking about getting into this industry, maybe you want to move, should we tell him to get a hold of Toby? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah, why not? Hey, Toby's looking for a couple wrenches. If you are a wrench, if you're a Mercury guy, uh, Mercury certified guy, uh, rigging guy, electronics guy, Toby's looking for a couple of those guys down at Jetta Marine. So get yourself, type in Jetta Marine, uh, look him up, get a hold of Toby. He's looking for a couple wrenches. Uh, he needs a couple good, reliable guys that want to show up for work. If you're one of those guys, give him a call. See what happens, all right? See what happens. And maybe you can relocate to Kentucky, fish Kentucky Lake, do all that good stuff, have a good time, and then hang out with... Um, 
Toby down there at Jetta Marine and see what's going on. So check that out. Check out David, DD26. Go check out Avid. Make sure you get on Bill's Marine. Get check that out. And always check our stuff out. Um, every week, dropping one, two videos, something like that. Jordan, what about what about Team Marine TV? Have we done anything there? Uh, we have a... Are we getting a little slow on that? What's we, going on? Who's uh, in production? Who's on the production side of that? A little bit. All right. We have a all-new video coming next week. We do? Yep. All new? Yep. You and the production crew are on it. Yep. Huh. It's going to be awesome. Do I know what this is? Um, At what point did I quit getting approvals on this? Because when we started this, you would give me, hey, how's this look? Approval? Yeah. And now that don't happen. Once you approve four or five of them in a row, we know we're good. All right, good. Awesome. Perfect. That's great. Anyway, hey, that's it. We're done. We're done having fun. You can have that. Um, I'm going home. I'm getting out of here. And as always, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell to witness the madness that uh, all the crew standing with Jordan is ready to say, speed, money, no breaks. I'm out. Hey, Zach, Bill's Marine, thanks, buddy. Appreciate it. You might want to talk to Philip, see what's going on. But we're out. See ya.